<sighs> okay. Hey guys. Just wanted to pop on here really fast. And um, I just got home from church. I'm exhausted. It's been a crazy wild day. And um, I just wanted to tell everybody what happened really fast. Um, first, uh, when I got to Vulcan this morning, um, one of my friends uh, that I have been um, emailing with for 10 years, her name is Denise, I've never met her in person, and she was at Vulcan, like she came from Chicago to surprise me. I was like, I started crying. So that was like the beginning of the day at Vulcan. So my wonderful friend Denise, I love you so very much. She came just for today, like she flew here just for me and then left, total surprise. Oh, I can't even believe it. So anyway, um, the day was just, I'm, I can't even process everything that's happened today. Like so much went on, like I've talked to so many people. The mayor of Birmingham is so fun. I thought he was a hoot and I told him he smelled good. Oh my gosh, what was I thinking? But he did, he smelled really good. Um, but he said that I was like, uh, had a wild imagination, which was so fun. <laughs> hey Tracy. Um, but this is the big news. Um, I'm going to Liverpool. <laughs> I'm going to freaking Liverpool! Oh my gosh! Um, they told me today that I'm going to Liverpool probably in March. So, um, <laughs> I cannot believe it. I'm totally still like in utter shock about this. But, um, they, the people from Liverpool are coming here and they're gonna get groovy. Um, hey everybody, um, they're gonna get groovy in February, and then I will be going to Liverpool in March, and I'm going to be, um, spending time with other artists in Liverpool, uh, and I'm gonna get to collaborate with them, and kind of, like, get, absorb some of the culture, and then I'm going to do another art project here, <laughs> um, so, ah! I can't believe it. I'm totally shocked. So they told me, asked me if I had my passport. And I said no. And he told me I better get it. So <sighs> anyway, <laughs> I, I'm still like in utter shock. This day has been so crazy good. Crazy, crazy good. And um, I just want to tell you guys, <clears throat> I shared this tonight in my class, <clears throat> my Bible art journaling class. Um, God gave me the word fruitfulness for 2016. And let me tell you what, God has been fulfilling that over and over again and in so many ways, in small ways, big ways. And if you know me, have known me very long, you know that England is like got a huge place in my heart. Like I have loved England since I was a little bitty kid. And for me to be going to England is like a dream come true. Um, but to go with my art is... <laughs> something that I can't even describe. Um, to have your art be looked at and talked about and loved. Um, I never imagined that this would be the path that God has put me on. And so I just wanted to say that never give up on your dreams. If God's given you something in your heart, you never know when it's going to come to pass. Okay. <sighs> I'm just like, try not to cry right now but anyway I just wanted to share that with you because I didn't feel like typing that out it was too big a news to just type it I wanted to tell you in person live and for those replay viewers that will come on later um <laughs> never be the same Tom hey Tom come with me go in my luggage everybody else is wanting to you can join in <laughs> so yeah Liverpool here I come I'll be there and I don't really know all the details about it yet. I don't know um, who I'm going with. I don't know. I do know I'm going with the, the I think he's the consulate to Japan I'm going with. Um, I don't know if the mayor's going. I know he was supposed to go. The mayor of Birmingham was supposed to go before, but the trip got canceled. So I don't know if he's going. So I may be going with the mayor. I'm not sure who I'm going with or how long I'll be there or what so um when i find out more information i will be sure to let you guys know but i just want to thank everybody who's been encouraging me and excited about groovy and has realized that he's like my heart groovy's been my heart for since july and um he's back here at the house with me and he will be until february but i just want to thank you guys your encouragement your love your 
my heart is is about to burst open with joy and gratitude and everything so anyway it's been a great day and um i just want to say thank you to my my friends and my family that came today um what an incredible experience today has been and um oh, and my two aunts i heard them behind me crying at one point and it was really cool um just to see my family there rallied around me and i wish my cousins could have been there but i know they had to work and um, some of you that wanted to be there, it just meant a whole lot that you wanted to be. So I know that you were there in spirit. And um, anyway, oh, and I was on the news, by the way. It's on the news. Um, I think my mom posted the link. I don't even know. I have not been on Facebook today at all. I've got, I'll be doing all that tomorrow, posting things. I have a bunch of pictures, oodles, oodles of pictures and video and stuff like that. I think my mom posted a link from uh, CBS. Um at W-I-A-T CBS here in Birmingham um, and I'll post a link on here too when I get on my computer in a little bit so anyway I love you guys so very much my heart is full and ah, thank you love you Liverpool here I come <laughs> bye guys